In this video, we are going to learn about Jaguars. It is going to be awesome. So what are Jaguars? Well, Jaguars are wildcats that live in the Americas. Now, you might be wondering, where in the Americas do Jaguars live? That's a good question. Well, Jaguars live in the southwestern United States, Central America, and South America. Seeing Jaguars in the southwestern United States is rare, but it does happen. Jaguars have been seen in California, Arizona, and Texas, but most Jaguars live in Central and South America. One of the things that Jaguars are famous for is their size. That's right, Jaguars are the largest cats in North and South America. They are huge! Jaguars can weigh over 300 pounds. That's right, a lot of their weight is muscle. These are really strong cats. Hey, they even have more muscles than you, Billy. For example, the muscles in their jaw are so powerful they can bite through a skull. That's right. They have one of the most powerful bites in the cat world. Their jaws are strong enough to drag as many as 800 pounds across the ground. That's so strong. Wow. Next, we are going to talk about what jaguars look like. Besides just cool. They do look cool. Don't be jealous, Mr. Whiskers, okay? You look cool, too. Most jaguars have a coat that looks like a blend between orange and yellow with lots of spots. Spots near the neck and head are solid. The rest of the spots are generally more colorful with brown inside. You might have realized this already, but jaguars look very similar to leopards. It can be hard to tell the difference between the two. A lot of people don't know the difference between the two, but not you. We are going to share an easy way to tell a jaguar from a leopard. It's all about the spots. The spots on jaguars and leopards are called rosettes. That's right, rosettes. That's an interesting name, isn't it? They are called rosettes because they are shaped like roses. That makes sense. So what is the easy way you can tell the difference between jaguars and leopards? Well, jaguars have much bigger rosettes. Not only that, but the rosettes have black dots in them. Leopards have many more rosettes than jaguars, but they are much smaller and do not have the dots inside of them. There's also a size difference. Jaguars are much bigger and stronger than leopards. There are other differences too, but those are the main ones. So the easiest way to spot the difference between a jaguar and a leopard is looking at their rosettes. But why do they even have rosettes? What's the purpose? Well, Rosettes are found on other types of cats as well, not just jaguars and leopards, but why do they have them? That's a great question. Well, rosettes are important because they help a cat camouflage. Part of what makes jaguars so tricky to find in the wild is the fact that they have these huge rosettes on their coats. We just finished talking about what jaguars look like. And while most jaguars look like that, some jaguars don't. There are jaguars that actually have a black coat. That's right. They have rosettes too, but it is usually really hard to see them. These jaguars are called melanistic jaguars. Melanistic Jaguars. Can you say that? Yeah. Melanistic Jaguars. It means they have a dark colored coat. There is a different name that most people call Melanistic Jaguars. What do you think that is? Yeah. 
Melanistic jaguars are usually called black panthers. Black panthers found in Central and South America are melanistic jaguars. Black panthers that live in Africa and Asia are actually melanistic leopards. Black panthers are not their own species. Black panthers are either leopards or jaguars. These black jaguars, commonly called black panthers, do very well in the wild. They use their black coats to their advantage by hunting at night. It is very difficult to see a black panther while it is hunting. If you want to impress someone, the next time you hear about black panthers, just let them know. Black panthers that live in Central and South America are actually melanistic jaguars. If they don't believe you, you can invite them to look it up and they'll be like, what, are you an animal expert? The next thing we want to learn about are jaguar babies. Yeah, so cute. Jaguar babies are called cubs. That's right. Cubs are born blind and can't see until they are two weeks old. Jaguar cubs stay in the same den that they were born in until they are about six months old. Then a jaguar cub is ready to go hunting with mommy. Once jaguars are fully grown, they are usually very solitary. They like to hunt and do things on their own. Jaguars are hunters through and through. They not only hunt on land, but can hunt in the water too. They are great swimmers. Whatever they catch doesn't have much of a chance. Remember what we shared about the jaw of a jaguar? It can bite through a skull. The final fact we are going to talk about is sad. The jaguar population has been declining and jaguars are now considered nearly threatened. Like many other animals around the world, jaguars have suffered because of deforestation. Jaguars are also hunted by people, a problem that has been difficult to stop. If the jaguar population isn't protected, they might become a threatened species. Jaguar, so awesome, so cool. The largest cats in North and South America. They mainly live in Central and South America, though some have been seen in the Southwestern United States. They have huge rosettes. They are really strong hunters. And what? Black Panthers that live in Central and South America are actually Jaguars with a black coat? I mean, tell us in the comment section below what surprised you the most in this video. What fact made you like, what? We can't wait to hear from you and we appreciate you spending time with us. Thanks for learning about Jaguars. Thanks for learning with us. This was great. The good news is that the learning can keep going and going. Check out one of these two videos, or if you haven't yet, click the circle in the middle of the screen to subscribe. Don't stop here. There is more to learn.